how y'all doing? Tonight I'm going to be changing a steering stabilizer link on a 2005 Ford F-250. Thanks for tuning in. Alright, this is the link we're going to be changing right, right here. Make sure you spray everything down with penetrating oil. Make it come apart easier. Loosen up your bottom nut. And take off your top nut. Pull that bushing off, and it's removed. All right, so this is my new sway bar link. Um, this is from Rock Auto. Dot com. It's the cheapest place I can find parts. Um, it says to torque the bolt and nut up here to 111 foot pounds up top. And down on the bottom it says we're going to torque this to 59 foot pounds. I'm not going to be using a torque wrench, but those are the torques if you choose to do so. So these separate. You can see the extended side of the bushing is down and it will be up to go through this bracket. Beveled washer. Go ahead and insert like so. And then you take your bottom with the extended side of the bushing up. Beveled washer. And before I do so, I'm going to put some anti-seize on the threads. So if I ever have to take this apart again, hopefully it comes apart easier. So man, I sees. Bushing washer washer and nut. Get that started. And the top side, the bolt. Doesn't come with a new bolt, so you have to use your old one. I'm going to anti-seize on the threads and shank. The washer goes in between the link and the steering stabilizer. So line that up. And nut on the back side. And again, this torque they say is 111 foot pounds. When you're torquing the top, you can see this is notch for a wrench, otherwise it'll spin on you. I'm sorry, when you are torquing the bottom so it doesn't spin. So when you're torquing the bottom, put a backing wrench on right here and you would torque this to 59 foot pounds.
And there we are. And then torque your top bolt to 111 foot pounds. All right, and your steering stabilizer link is installed. Thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.